actually. Yes, that was just me falling. Hello, hello, everybody. Uh, oh, I forgot rings. One second. Much better. Hello, everybody. I hope you are doing well. Today, as you can see, we are doing what I'm wearing this summer. Miss Emma Chamberlain setting the YouTube trends. Um, I also got a couple comments asking to do this video. So I was like, you know what, let's do it. I'm not doing like another 21 full outfits. I think Emma did that, but I think I might do like around 15 or something just because honestly, I don't really know what I'm wearing this summer. So I'm just like planning some fun summery fits. I planned most of these, some of them I haven't. So we're gonna see, we're gonna play around with it. It's also freezing out. I don't know what happened to New York's whole catching spring and summer vibe here. Um, I'm literally drinking a hot coffee, which I don't really get hot coffees very often. Um, it's freaking cold and it's also really cold in my room right now. So I'm like, yes, yeah, so I'm just gonna wear this like bikini with these shorts and I'm like so cold, but that's okay. Also, again, still construction going on, so I'm very sorry if you guys are hearing that. I'm trying to do, like, obviously outfits that I will wear and, like, stuff like that, but I do understand my style isn't for everybody, so I'm definitely going to try to, like, do some outfits that I feel like everybody could wear and mix those in because, obviously, that's, like, easier for ins. But, I mean, even this outfit that I'm wearing right now, not many people would wear because it's, like, chaotic and mixing prints and probably ugly for some people, but you know what? This is what I'm wearing for summer. I could blabber on, but I think we should get into it because this could be a long one. Okay, let's do it. Starting with the outfit I have on. Okay, so I would normally maybe film in my living room as I did for my 21 outfits. But again, I'm not the only one in this apartment, so I'm not trying to like use up every space in the apartment. So we're going to try to do it in my room. So this outfit, here we go. I also like these glasses with it, so I'm gonna put them on. Here's what we're going with. This top was in the Trinity Ace Bundle. Skirt is like a little floor length. Maxi skirt that I got at a thrift shop. It's really cute and I love the pattern and I honestly think the mixing patterns is cute with this. I did a little white heel, but you could do like any shoe with this. I kind of struggled picking a shoe because I don't know. I feel like cowboy boots could be cute with this too, but like my black ones kind of looked a little weird. I like doing the off the shoulder thing with this top with like a cute little bag and like fun hair. Going out to brunch with the girls. Um, I don't know. I just think it's fun. A little like neck scarf thing. Oh wow. It was like not centered that whole time but this is from the sage vintage it was one of like the little neck scrap pieces that she made me but it's so cute to wear as like a little choker honestly i'm into like <laughs> bringing not necessarily bringing like choker chokers back but like tying scarves kind of this way or like little ascots or little like pieces of fabric and stuff i just think it's like a really cute accessory in addition to like a necklace because sometimes I just wear my necklaces like over and over again and I just get tired of them so I feel like this is fun. It like matches some of the coral colors going on. It adds another pattern. I'm into it. Let's do some fun rings and that did not just happen on camera. My favorite glasses. You guys are kidding. The screw like came out. Okay, well, I'm going to locate the screw, but use your imaginations. I'm going to find the screw and then outfit two. Damn, rhyme. I'm going to write a haiku. Ah. Next fit, I kind of feel like anybody could wear this or like has a variation of this outfit. Um, I'm doing these Adidas pants from Cure Thrift Shop that I love and recently got and they fit kind of low waist on me, which I really like. I really like the colors of them too. And then I'm doing them with these little flip-flop platform flip-flops i love i think everybody needs like some crocs or some platform flip-flops or something for the spring and summer because they're such a fun shoe such an easy throw on kind of vibe and honestly i like platform flip-flops too in new york because they keep you like off the ground like i don't really like wearing flip-flops around new york just because like you know you pick up shit on your feet and it's like dirty and it's whatever so i don't really wear like open toe shoes a ton in new york unless they're like heels um but i love wearing platform flip-flops because they boost you off the ground a little bit ever think about that 
that's one reason to get some platforms. They have the brand Soda. And the platform's like not that chunky, but you can get chunkier platforms on Amazon, to be honest. Um, yeah, I stole these from my mom. It's weird. I have like big feet for like a 5'5 five five person. My mom's 5'11 and we share shoes. I'm like a nine, nine and a half. That kind of weird. And then this tank top I got off Depop with like matching like PJ boxer shorts. I'll put the Depop here. Um, because I can't remember it off the top of my head. I got it a while ago. But I thought it was cute because the green matches. But you could do like any graphic tee with this. This trucker hat I got at, um, I think it was like a Savers or a Salvation Army. They were selling like all these trucker hats. This one in green and then I have one in gray. But there was like nothing on here. And then I was like, oh my god, I'll take a Sharpie and draw all over it and do like a cool design. And then I like never finished it. And I just wrote Leo on it. And this necklace is from here. So, and I love it. And it's new and it's absolutely fantastic so it's summer vibes summer vibes and yeah okay that's out me too okay somebody in the movie white chicks wears an outfit that's really similar to this like this hat and this skirt something like something about this outfit is giving that movie i don't know if it's one of the twins but somebody in white chicks i'm gonna find the picture and put it right here because when i put this outfit on i was like whoa but here's the fit okay so this skirt it's from Funny Pretty Nice, new thrift store in New York. I showed this in my last video. I think I hauled it. So it comes down to Vinny's, which is kind of silly, but I think it's cute. And then, yeah, I'm just doing these Mark Fisher heels that I think are cute and like tie in the black. This skirt, I think honestly, this with like a bikini top in Miami would be so cute. Um, but I found this, I was looking through my graphic tees and I found the shirt and I was like oh the color scheme like matches darker like coral and ombre in it so went with this top it says fashion pirate which I love um I got it off depop and you know you can do a little kind of cute and then even like take the hat off do a little one of these you know what I'm saying I don't know I don't know if this is a look to bring these out but I had it with this kangle hat that I love and it's just tan. I got this one off of Depop. My pink one, my brother borrowed um, cause he had a disco night and he literally borrowed just like an outfit I would wear on the day-to-day -day basis for his disco night. Yeah, this is outfit three. Okay. I swear to God, is it the dance off in white chicks or somebody's worth doing this thing? Do you know what I'm talking about? Somebody be here with me. Are we here? I think we are. Okay, this one's already a little questionable. I get it. Um, I was going through my tops and I have like a lot of like lingerie tops that I bought that I like feel like I'm always going to layer with and I like never do. So I was like, let me try one out. So I thought the yellow would be cute with the blue, you know, and so I'm doing these pink heels to like connect the pink and these pants are really, really long. So you need the heel with it. I'm going to fall. I don't know. And then I did this pattern bag because I wanted to mix patterns and then the hat connects with the bag with the tan and then the scarf connects with the blue. God, I don't know. Okay, this is outfit four. That's all I'm gonna say about it. Next outfit. We're doing a lot of House of Sunny on the top, which is like annoying because I know It'd be like back order, it's expensive, it's also becoming super mainstream, but I just love these patterns and I think they're super cute together. And I feel like just wearing this alone is a lot. So I felt like I needed a little little shawl thing in the bobber. Here are the shoes I'm wearing. So yeah, I was thinking of wearing these with my grad dress and now there's no way in hell because I will fall. It's almost certain now. Both tops are House of Sunny. This is a swimsuit, but come on, this is summer fit. So like, yeah, I'm gonna wear a swimsuit as a top. Um, juicy couture bag that I thrifted. Then these pants are IMGia, my new brown leather. And pray for me, these shoes are Jeffrey Campbell. Oh, and hat is from For You Only. And I love it. This is my favorite hat of all time. The baby Grinch hat. Wow, my hat head. Woo! Keep that on, sis. Yeah, I love this hat. Okay. And this 
is my summer announcement. <laughs> I'm like not okay after that fall. I like literally twisted both ankles. I'm being dramatic. You can wear fur hats in the winter. I meant you can wear fur hats in the summer, like completely. This hat with the bikini, so fun. This hat with this shirt with the bikini, so fun. With a little summer dress, come on. There are no rules. Yeah, I almost just fell again. Okay, I'm gonna take these shoes off. Okay, this outfit is giving like, if you were having like a 70s work party. Because we're doing like a trouser. Okay, I gotta do this lower. Kind of an interesting way to wear this headband. I don't know if it's working or not, but I like pulled my hair over and I like the headband with my butterfly top. I thrifted this, it's one of my favorite thrifted finds. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I think it looks cute with these pants. Um, I don't know if all of this goes together, but it's fun. I said in one of my other videos, trousers are like a really fun summer pant. I pair them with like a cute little sexy top. It's like a good balance of like, like sophisticated boss bitch, hashtag girl boss, and like sex appeal. I don't know. I didn't really have a bag to go with it, so we just did this bag, the Femina Clothing on Depop. Um, but these pants are like striped, if you can see, purple and black. Um, I hate, hate, hate how the zipper does that. It literally looks like a coochie, you know? They're like bootleg, and I'm doing them again with the black Mark Fisher little kitten heels. Okay. This outfit is sending me. My tape keeps popping out on the side. I like it. You could do just like normal jean shorts. Okay, so this is a one piece, right? And it's super 80s, like really funky, whatever. And I love it, right? And I definitely splurged on this. It's from this seller. Um, I think, I don't think it's Depop. I think she just has her own like vintage shop, but she makes these by hand, which is just insane. And so because I splurge on it, I was like, okay, I want to wear it like as a top. I want to be able to like wear it more. So here's that shorts. I've almost gotten rid of them so many times because they're like really not my style. Like, sorry, the pocket's all weird. Just like very preppy and like gingham. I don't know how to feel about it. Personally, I don't know. I'm kind of into it right now. I think the hat is like so funny with it. I honestly think a white visor would go crazy with this outfit. I wish I had a visor. I really want to start wearing visors this summer. So look out for that. I think visors will be fun. I think you should get a visor. Whoever's watching this. And I just amped it up with my Chiquito and I'm obsessed with her and I don't wear her enough. Um, and I think this is really cute. And then yeah, I have these loafers on. Got yeah, the gold in the loafer. <laughs> matches the golds in the jock mousse in the bag so yeah i think this is a funny outfit here's it without the bag you just hold the bag like this i like the fit of the shorts okay honestly yeah i'm digging it This terry cloth beach cover up is thrifted, I believe. I'll check the back and see if there's a tag. But I've only worn her once and I need to wear her more this summer. Um, so that's the plan. I'm doing these go go boots that I got from Nasty Gal. This fake Burberry bag, as you guys know, wear her all the time. Um, thrifted. Paired it with this hat. Just like this hat with a romper, like just makes sense, you know? These sunnies to match with the like turquoise or teal lining of the romper oh i forgot to open up this window one sec is that better lighting i keep having when i change i have to take the shades down because they're men right on my fire escape and that's why but uh, then you could just wear a bikini under it and then go to the beach and then after throw this on and then run errands afterwards or you know like beach cover-ups that also look like little fits are the fucking best I'm gonna show you another example of one. That was crazy, y'all. We just got like the link to pick our date for which graduation we're going to like attend. And I had a date that was like ideal for my mom and my grandma, who are my family members that are coming. So she was stressful. Anytime Fordham makes like a portal, like a time where like something is released and you have to like click on it, like registration, anything, it's a shit show. So that was crazy. I just did that. But okay, here's outfit. God knows, I don't know. It's another beach cover up. This is polo, and then I'm doing the fruit 
necklace again because I really love it. I mean, this big oversized shirt that I thrifted that's just like a cute, airy, nice beachy moment. I think it looks cute with the dress. These sunnies from Amazon. And I'm doing these little platform kickaroonies that don't really match, but I think they're kind of cute. They're Betsy Johnson, I believe. That's that on that. Here's another outfit. Um, and this one, I'm just wearing this bikini top that I thrifted. It's just brown, you know. I think it looks cute with these shorts that um i thrifted there's like brown in this little button i don't know i think they're cute and then obviously the cowboy boots then these sunnies from a woke vintage but they're the brand spitfire to go with all the brown i've also seen people do this y'all tell me if this is crazy it's when girls like okay, let me just let me just do it girls just wear their tanks like this do you know what i'm talking about I like, maybe I'm making this up. No, I think I've seen bitches do this. And they're like, you know, is that a vibe? It definitely feels weird. It definitely feels like I need to pull this down. I also think I'm kind of doing it with the wrong kind of tank top. But I dig it. I, I don't know if I'm digging this, but I've seen it. Do you guys agree? Have you seen it too? I don't know. Yeah. Okay, this one's very like 70s inspired. I'm wearing this like crochet bra, I guess, bathing suit top, but like you can't wear it swimming. Um, and then this like floor length slip with my boots and then I'm wearing my little pantaloons um, and this leather vest that I got on Depop. Um, but I think this is really cute. I would do like big hair hoops, a lot of necklaces, and like a fun bag. Um, but yeah, I think this is really cute. Okay, I'm sad because I just spilled on my skirt. So ignore that. I'm kind of like a Orson Iris inspired look here because they have like those really pretty silky kind of boxy crop tops and I have this set right this PJ set that I think would look really cute with it so they also sell like this kind of similar skirt with like the ruching and so I thought they would go really cute together which is like a plain white tank um I did my cowgirl boots but you could also do like kind of knee-high boots you could do like my brown leather ones um and then I really liked the um sage vintage neck piece with this look too with the purple i just thought it was really like simple and clean and cute and chic dinner brunch whatever look um and i like tied it around my neck and just cut my hair kind of like that because i kind of liked that then i just did the kangle hat as well but yeah i like this outfit okay we are giving full on Hannah Montana vibes. Got the Hannah Montana scarf, the Betsy Johnson cheetah mesh slip. I just did this cheetah bra that I have under it, which works. And then I did these flare black pants with my fuzzy heels. You guys know the ones. Um, I am into it telling you dresses over pants it's fun okay, another bathing suit look we've got my needed little skirt um okay, let me tilt this down a little bit so yeah so i just have this big oversized like linen -y, um hot pink shirt that i thrifted like a while ago um and then this hot pink bathing suit that's the brand doll i thrifted this i've got like my mint pantaloons underneath for backup um, but I think the knit skirt is so cute with this and these sunnies thrifted as well. Just have my hair in a clip and yeah, I just think this is so cute. You could do this with like flip flops, kitten heels, anything. Soup's cute. I think this is the last outfit. Ending it with the cute, I'm not getting older, I'm getting better moment. This shirt has like slits up the sides. 
So you gotta do a little something underneath. So I just did like this denim skirt and then I did this little denim vest and I've got my go-go's on. And I think it's really cute. I know the denims don't really match and that's kind of bothersome, but you know what? Just gotta go with it, gotta go with the flow. A cute little bag, just a fun little summer errands, you know. <laughs> I don't know, I think it's cute and I love this shirt so very much because I feel that. Um, yeah, you guys, okay. Let me do a little, do a little close out. Okay, everybody, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this, what I'm wearing this summer video. Definitely was fun to like experiment in my closet. Get some ideas going. Um, I'm very excited for the summer. Summer's my favorite season. I'm a July Leo, so come on now. Hope it gave you some kind of inspo, and if it didn't, hope you just enjoyed watching and chilling with me. So I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you again for watching, and... Bye-bye.